Well, for Spartan Nation and for the family, welcome into sports, everyone. As we all know, recognition comes few and far between when it comes to the athletic talent across the desert southwest. But in some cases, a diamond in the rough can shine to the surface. And for Central's Jared Martin, all eyes are now on him, entering just his junior season as one of the most sought-after high school football prospects. And I sat down with him one-on-one -on -one as he now finds himself in a pool of endless opportunities. One to the left, and he's going to get brought down the edge rusher, Jared Martin, coming off the edge for the sack in Southwest. My uncle played pro baseball. My dad played pro baseball. So, like, sports has like, always been like a really big thing in my family. An edge rusher, an athlete, Jared Martin, simply a physical menace on any playing field. Not to say like, it wasn't a surprise, but, like, it's kind of like, it was like more like a win than, like, not, like, it wasn't like a if, it was more of a when, like, I was going to get this, like, attention. We've always known that this is, like, high school isn't, like, the, the, like the finish line. It's always, beyond, it's always been beyond that. Upon entering his junior year, that attention has arrived. Gets a block. Youngers get stripped from behind. Ball is loose. Central football. Picked up by Jared Martin, the sophomore. As a three-sport athlete, Jared has excelled in every way, quickly opening doors to a future athletically beyond El Centro, living out his dream on the grounds he grew up on. There's nothing like there's nothing like playing in the, on this field on Friday night. Playing at Central, playing on Cal Jones Field, it's just like when you play here, it's just something like special. Especially me growing up, I've always like I was the little kid in the back. Play, like back to the bleachers back over there in the field playing like watching these guys play now wearing number 22 a legacy number passed down through the martin family lineage jared sporting it as the newest central spartan standout and with the spotlight comes recognition as offers have been flooding in for the six foot three 220 pound frame martin stacking up 12 division one offers to date and taking the field as number 10 for on three elites list of top football recruits in the entire state of california it's it's a dream come true like ever since i was a little kid my older brother was telling me he was like dude like you like have everything it takes to be to play at the next level and even more for me to be able to be able to actually live it and to be like I mean there's not a lot of people who've been in my shoes before especially from the valley like even just being from here like being knowing that I didn't like leave or like that I didn't like go chase it that it kind of came to me that it was kind of like a it's kind of like a really like real like special thing to me and like our, my family Martin just began his tackle football journey two years ago as a freshman instantly coming into the fold for coach rookie Pena and the Spartans and after just two seasons, Martin racked up 71 tackles, 20 of those for a loss and 19 sacks, paving the way for a life in football after high school. And in the meantime, putting El Centro on the map for something bigger than the sport itself. The game of football is, it saves a lot of people. Like, it's done a lot of things for a lot of people, and it's definitely doing a lot of things that it's, go it's going to do, and it is doing a lot of things for my family and for just just my future. Just that I get the opportunity to be able to put like El Centro on the map a little bit, kind of like Royce Freeman, the way he did growing up. Uh, just like it's it's a real like it's a real blessing. I'm real honored and like real humble to like just be able to like be a part of something that's bigger than just me because it's not just me. I, like it doesn't just affect me. Like this this whole process affects everybody.